What is up, my Hylians? This is Masterling40, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. If you guys remember in the last episode, we started up the Fire Temple and got ourselves the dungeon item, the Megaton Hammer. In today's episode, we're going to finally finish the rest of the Fire Temple. But before we get started, please do me a huge favor and please click on that like button. It really does help out the series. It really does. Now, how's everyone doing today? I hope everyone's having an awesome day. Now, um, to move on to the rest of this dungeon, what we're going to do now is use a Megaton Hammer on this platform. And then, boom, it's going to drop. Man, boom, here's... Now, you might be wondering what the heck do you want to do with that. So, pretty simple enough. Go ahead and use your Megaton Hammer, and then, boom, and get rid of these things, and you're, you're good to go. And I better make sure I heal before trying to the boss and got some more fire keys these guys are annoying as crap get away get away that's fantastic thanks for the arrows but I don't need them well could use it to kill these other fire keys here we go nope I'm a lousy shot lousy shot lousy shot lousy shot lousy shot Got one. Try again. Alright, one more. There we go. Hey, those are good hearts. Need them, need them, and they're about to disappear. Great. So what we're going to do now is... Use your Mega Knight Time Hammer on this platform, and then there should be some steps coming down. Alrighty, so... And that beeping is really annoying. So what we're going to do now is drop, go all the way right down there, and then you notice there's the blue switch. So what we're going to do is place this box right down here, because if we just sit, step right there, the bar is going to go right back down. So, boom, simple as that. And down with that, and use this platform to go down. And before we break this platform to go down, what we're going to do now is step on this rusted switch that never will explain to us. And then, boom, this door shall be open. Now, you notice we have been here before. So, the next thing we're going to do is come right over here and play the Song of Time once more. Oh, no, 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 no. That's just great. If you hear anything in the background, my apologies, because... I I really don't I don't know. No, it's what's in, when you play the song of time, you notice there's another rusted block. Go ahead and use your Megaton hammer, and then boom, there goes another Goron arrested for some reason. Alrighty, and let's go ahead and open up this chest to get our final small key. Yes, our very final small key. Not a final key, but our final small key. Alright, so uh, what's the secret you need to tell me, Goron? A door is hidden inside the statue at the entrance to this temple. But the Goron's special crop won't work on it. Don't you have anything stronger? Hmm. What do I have stronger? Hmm. But we'll talk about that later. So what we're going to do now is climb all the way back over here and head back to that door. This way? Yes, this way. And now, let's hit this platform. And let's hit it fast before that keys tried to hit. That's nah, not happening. But I won't take damage right here, because I'll be alright. <laughs> and then boom, we can get right over here, but we don't have the big key. Or the boss key. Whatever you like to call it. I bet you might be wondering, where the heck is the boss key? Good question. I know where it is. And watch out for the fire keys. Oh my gosh, get away. Stupid. Hey, thank you for the heart. 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 Now, you should remember these plat platforms. You remember these little statue thingies. So what we're going to do is use your Megaton Hammer and get that out of the way. And look at that. Another locked door. Yeah, we couldn't have access to this before. Now we have access to it. Boom. Let's go ahead and open it up. Now what you'll find in here is some fire keys and some torch slugs. Let's go ahead and defeat them all and able to move on. Stupid keys. Ugh. Come on. Yeah, I can use, sure use some magic. Thanks a lot. I can sure use some magic. And I can definitely use a heart. Because I'm not ready to die yet. 
But I would definitely like to heal myself before moving on. So I think I'll just do that before entering the boss, so... Alrighty, well, after killing one of the enemies, we can now move on. Now the next room, you will find yourself another Ghost Cthulhu and another Like Like. So, let's go ahead and take care of these things real quick. If you guys don't know what like likes do, I'll explain to you one again. These guys will take your tunics and your shield, your Highland shield, and your Goron or Zora tunic. They will not take your Kokiri tunic because they just won't take it. <laughs> Alright, that's taken care of. And then boom. We got ourselves eight, another Ghost Cthulhu. Let's see how many Ghost Cthulhu's do we have right now. We have a total of 16. I think we need to have 30 and able to get the giant wallet. But anyways, let's go ahead and move on, and we'll have another Flare Dancer mini-boss fight. So, let's go ahead and equip our hookshot, and then let's go ahead and start. Get back here. Alright, that's one, two more times. Using the big on sword make this battle goes by real quick. I think it takes more hits with the master sword for some reason. Whoa boy. I believe we went ahead right over there. Hmm. Alrighty. That's done. And then boom, you got yourself another rusted switch. Then boom, you'll have the final rescued Goron. And the boss key. Wow. Alrighty then. Now we can get inside to the boss room, baby. Yes. Yes. Are you releasing me? Yes. I didn't even know what that said. But... He just said, please help me, big brother. Please help us. I promise I will help you guys. Yes, we will. Hylian Squad, we will help these guys. Yes, we will. Alright, before we head over to the boss room, I need to go heal. So, I'll be right back. Oh, before I forget, there is an upgrade that we can get right after getting the Megaton Hammer. So, let's go ahead and grab that. And this will this is just in time just to heal myself. <laughs> So, let's head over right back over here, because I don't understand why we're <laughs> interrupting in the middle of a dungeon, because I usually never do this. <laughs> so, what we're going to do now is not going to head over back to Goron City. We're going to head over right past over here, and if you try using, try to get rid of these boulders, if you try using bombs, they won't explode. You need the Megaton Hammer to get rid of these. These take about two... Yeah, about two swings on each boulder. So and we got ourselves another great fairy's fountain. So let's go ahead and play Zelda's Lullaby. Welcome, Link. I am the Great Fairy of Wisdom. I'm going to enhance your magic power. Receive it now. Alright, while we get healed, we're also going to get... Oh, that feels good. Yes! We'll also get a magic meter upgrade, basically. Or a magic meter as enhanced. Your magic power has been enhanced. Now you have twice as much magic power. When Balas made you weary, please come back to see me. Remember our magic bar? Our magic bar is twice as big now. 
So, we have more magic as before. Yes! Alrighty, guys. I'll meet you guys back in the fire temple. Alrighty, fellows. We're back in the fire temple. Let's go ahead and head straight to the boss. Here we go. Alrighty, here we go. Alright, so I, what I usually recommend, of course, the Megaton Hammer and Arrows. So here we go. And like I said, keep your growing tunic on. Alright. Right, quick cut about that my apologies I got interrupted by one of the family members and I'm just gonna have to edit the introduction <laughs> to the boss so let's go ahead and get started <laughs> this is gonna take a little bit so once he's like that in that method go ahead and get your megaton hammer ready and attack him and don't do that all right here we go again ready boom and get your bigger on sword ready or your megaton hammer and attack him And when he's in that mode, go ahead and try to use arrows and try to attack him. Because I know you'll miss a couple times and you'll get him sometimes. Alright, that's about four hits. Alright, then he's going to go back into there, right down there. So, let's go ahead and get a Megaton here. Am I ready? And like I said, the bigger on Sword does more damage than the Master Sword, which I kind of really hate. Because like I said, the Master Sword. And yes, please watch out for that when he's like that. What the crap was that? I forget how much damage Volvagia takes, but no big deal. I have a blue potion and a fairy, so I'm not going to worry about that. That's crazy. So yeah, watch out for that damage, because that's honestly really going to be a pain. And yeah, don't worry about falling either. Okay, when he's like that, I recommend you go right down here. Alrighty then, let's go ahead and get our Megaton hammer ready, hammer ready again. And let's see where he spawns. Come Ooh. I didn't realize that either. <laughs> Alrighty, fellas. I uh, hope we don't get a game over yeah. Where are you, Bobaya? Get your stupid self over here. Alright, please. I know it's not going to be the final hit. Oh, it is the final hit. Yeah. We defeated Bobaya, people. Yes. And my apologies once again for cutting that previous time because, like I said, one of the family members interrupted me for some reason. Because, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> but anyways, Pelagia is now defeated and the fifth dungeon is now completed. Wow. This is going to take a while to edit a bit. Let's see, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I believe this is our tenth heart container. Yes, I am correct. Let's get out of here. Okay then, note to self, never put your controller on the desk by the microphone. <laughs> okay, I'll keep that in mind next time. <laughs> Thank you, brother. I really appreciate what you did. I thank you on behalf of the entire Goan race. You turned out to be a real man, just as I thought you would. 
By the way, I, the wild Darunia, turned out to be the great sage of fire. Isn't that str funny, brother? Well, this must, this must be what they call destiny. Nothing has made me happier than helping you seal the evil here. Hey, brother, take this. Take this. This is a medallion that contains the power of the fire spirits and my friendship. And we have obtained the fire medallion. Alright, we received the fire medallion. Darunia has awakened as a sage and has his power to yours. Don't forget, now you and I are true brothers. Alrighty, that will conclude today's episode. My apologies once again for the interruption. It's gonna kinda take me a while to edit that out. <laughs> but anyways, I thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, please give this video a thumbs up. Comment as many times as you like. If you haven't already, subscribe and join the Highland Squad. And I'll see you guys in the next episode of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Goodbye.